and welcome back to my channel. My name is Emily if you're new here and as you can tell by the title, today's video is going to be about my bunny room tour slash setup. This room is also my cat's room and he likes to spend a lot of his time in this room as well because this room is also the sunroom. And as you can tell, we have some special guests. We have Bobo, Ellie right there. Ollie is in the corner munching on his palm leaf bowl right now and Reggie is currently being disturbed by Ellie because he's trying to take a nap. Another thing I like to mention is the majority of the items in this room is either from Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, Ross, but mostly IKEA. Like almost everything in this room is from IKEA. So I'm not gonna be saying where everything is from. I'm just gonna be putting something here or here. We'll see where the item is from. So without further ado, let's get on with the video. When you're not here, the sun don't shine. When you're not near, I don't feel like I do. When When I decided to make you mine, I'm never going back. I know that's a fact. So Ellie is currently on the cat tree, hanging out as she does. Say hi. Her nickname is also main character because she's the center of attention. Okay, maybe Reggie is. You want to show everyone your cat tree? Or do you want Ellie to show you? That's the camera. <laughs> Alright, you two. So this is the entrance. There's no gate or anything. So they are free roam. But this is like their main living situation. Where they like to hang out. And I also have another door right here. So this is also my office where I like to work. And over here is the room. This is Reggie's cat tree. Everything right here is all Ikea, except for that. This is from Home Goods. This pillow is from H&M Home. That pillow is from Target. And I also like to hang this little toy for the buns. They like to come and nibble on it sometimes and it's perfect because my coffee table has these little holes and I could just change out the toys but I currently have this one hooked on so pretty neat right Ellie you like it are you eating your cicatrope and this is Reggie's litter box that we DIY'd currently using a bathroom so I'm not going to disturb him Okay, and over here, as Re Reggie is showing you, this is the couch. And I also like to protect it with just like a throw blanket I got from Ikea. And it's easily replaceable if it gets dirty. I could wash it. And it's only, I think, like $3.99, so it's great. So this is an overview of Little House Bun's little setup. Okay, and let's start here. So I have an ottoman over here, as well as this bed with a little cushion. So they can hop on and off, and they also can go under here if they choose to. I have two cardboard shoes. And I have this rug here. That's also the same as these two rugs that I have on top of the litter boxes, but we'll get to that leader. Over here I have a cat tunnel and also this cardboard shoe and this is actually a tile but it looks like a tree trunk and I got this from Ross and I love it and I like to feed their veggies and pellets on top. And this is one of her favorite toys. It's a palm leaf plate. She loves it. 
And then these are the three bath mats that they both like to lay on. And it's easy to clean because they're washable. And this is the water bowl. And I love it. It's from Marshalls. But I also seen it at Home Goods and TJ Maxx before. And this is a little pet camera from Amazon. I think it's by the brand Blink. And I have a fake plant hanging on the curtain rod. And over here, I have the three name tags, Ellie, Ollie, and Winston. And Winston is from Etsy. And this is the egg chair on top of this rug, which I love. And the egg chair can be found at Marshalls, also seen at Home Goods and TJ Maxx. And this is a two-in-one. It's a fan and heater system that I got from Costco. During the summer, I used the fan. In the winter, I used the heater. And I love it because it has a safety feature. So when it tips over, it automatically shuts off. And I feel really safe using it. So you just turn it on. And right now it's on fan mode, but it's loud, so I have it off. But you could also use it as like a heater. And this is a tile if they wanna like lay on it, if they get hot. I have this carrot garland, which I got in the Easter section at Home Goods during Easter time. This house, I love it so much because it is so roomy for both of them. And I found this on Etsy. I'll name the shop name here. They also made the Ellie and Ollie names that were on the ornaments. And in the house, I just have a branch stick thing for them to chew and some cardboard. And over here, I have a little cat scratcher, which was actually from Reggie's cat tree. And they just like laying on it. And I have this vase on top of this chair with these two figurines from Hobby Lobby. And in the vase, I just have some dry florals, some eucalyptus, willows and baby's breath and this is the lantern it's from ikea i love it because it matches the house with the stars and ollie is just relaxing in there he's currently molting so he has a funny hairdo right now and i love the windows and the design on this it's so intricate and over here i have their digging box and this is a diy that i followed from i'll put instagram user over here and in it, I have some natural chew toys and some aspen bedding. So this aspen bedding is really safe for them to use. They just like digging in it. Hopefully they don't pee in it. They haven't peed in it yet. And I have some cut up paper towel rolls and some Timothy hay straws. I also have these loofahs that I grown last year in my garden that I dried. And now I cut them up and they're in here for them. And some pine cones and these wooden chew toys as well as these apple sticks and they just like to throw all of these toys around toss it around dig it it's just a great digging box overall and over here i have the air purifier and it's by lavolt i love it it gets rid of all the smells and a plus it collects some fur and i just place it right next to the litter box and it could get all those smells just purified. Over here, I have a crate and it's also a Heidi house. And I have a cushion on top, Reggie and the buns both like using it and they like to look out the window. And these are my litter boxes and I just place the rugs on top. And inside I have DIY litter boxes as well as this plastic storage bin container from ikea that i use as a hay rack i love it because i used to have like fabric hay racks and they just chewed it and digged it up so this is what works for me and i have two of them and they're both identical so here is the overview again of my office and this is where they basically hang out so yeah i'm currently loving this setup might change in the future because i always change your setups because i do get bored of it very easily so let me know what you guys think i hope you guys get inspired i also have an amazon storefront where you can shop all of our favorites and i'll link that in the description below all right guys that's all for today's video and i hope you guys enjoyed the bunny room as much as i love this room and so does the bunnies and if you guys have any questions please feel free to leave it down below in the comments and if you enjoyed this video please hit a thumbs up also, if you want more behind the scenes, make sure to follow us on Instagram at Little House Buns. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.